Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host. I'm here rolling solo dolo, as always, on this Madden 19 Browns franchise rebuild. So, Chuck and Wayne Season 8, as always, playing offense only, simming that D, using the balanced playbook. So, we've had a pretty easy couple first games here. Not going to lie, uh, I feel pretty good about how we're doing. Uh, we had, we got a couple major signings going on this year as we get a little later into the year. Uh, we got Ellis the Dyson Baca, my main running back. He's, he's due a big deal, man. I've, I've brought him up from a rookie into a stud-ass running back, so now I got to pay the man. I just paid... Zach, the dream weaver. Um, he he's he's signed on for a long time. He's lots of money. So now I guess uh, we got to try to lock in some of these other folks, man. We got uh, the the wide receiver, D'Antoine, the headless horseman, Hanoian. I got him locked in for a few more seasons. Uh, Patrick, the Colonel Kerr. Is coming up due this year. Carol, the magician, the tall. My uh, my second running back of my dual-headed rushing attack. He's also he's kind of like he's kind of going side to side because side to side. Because if I can't sign Barker for a reasonable amount, I guess I'll just let him go and do Carol Tall full time. So there's kind of like a little bit of double things on that. I should be able to re-sign uh, the Colonel, Patrick Kerr Holloway. I got him for two more seasons. That's Marshall, Ping Pong Holloway. And then we had, uh, oh shit, oh god, Maven, why are you so open? You never do anything, but I get you a little, gotta throw a dog a bone every so often. That's my fullback. He's always the blocker. He's not great. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, he's, he's turning the corner. I say that all the time, and then he does nothing. Uh, we'll see. I mean, he'll get up there. He's he's pretty young. I drafted him as a rookie, too. So, we're going to keep going. We're going to go down here. We're going to show Miami why they are trash. Oh, God. Get out of my face. Um, chug it along. So, let's see here. Uh, we're going to do the China special. Uh, mainly because I clicked the button by accident. Uh, so, I guess that'll work. All right. Let's take a look here. So... Um, okay. I'm going to run with the Dreamweaver. Oh, God. Get the first. Oh, Jesus. He d what the fuck just happened there? All right, we'll get it. We'll get... Hey, you know, it's not all graceful. All right, we're going to go ahead and bring in uh, the Dreamweaver. He, he gets... Right now, basically, I'm being a cheap ass, so I don't want him to get too good. So right now, he's getting five carries a game. Uh, what my plan is, is once I re-sign him, him and Barker got him locked in, whatever... I am going to basically just give one of them a couple sets and give the other one a couple sets. And uh, and then whatever plays I run, whoever gets more carries, I don't really care. So uh, it doesn't really matter. I mean, I would like to keep both of them if I can, but I'm not going to break the goddamn bank to keep up. Oh, yeah, the Headless Horseman. Look at him, folks. That's why he's headless. He doesn't have any fear. You can't break his dome because his dome is not there to be broken. It's like the old tutelage. Uh, can't break a dome that's not there. That's I have no idea. That's probably not anything. I just made that up. But, you know. So, we, uh, we're going along here. And, of course, we already have B. Goodman, Brady, the... Fall down. The, the Dyson's broken, folks. He doesn't know how to pick up the dirt anymore. Uh, B. Goodman, Brady Goodman, the goodest man. B. Good man, my tight end. He's locked in for a while too. So, so once I get this, once I'm done with this season here, hopefully, I'll have my quarterback, two running backs, two wide receivers, and a tight end locked in long term. So this will be like the foundation for like the next few seasons of this franchise. Um, I'm not sure how long I'm going to keep the franchise going. I mean, I am in eighth season. I didn't expect to keep it going eight, eight years. Oh, ho, ho, the goodest man. Oh, B. Goodman. He's so always oh, doing the robot. He's like, I'm B. Goodman. Do you want to be my friend? Eh. Uh, so we'll see. I don't know, man. I don't know what I want to do. I mean, people keep watching it. So 
I mean, it must be somewhat enticing. With I mean, there's nobody left that's like a regular player, so it's fine with me, though. I'm completely okay with that. I don't mind playing the Browns. I like the Browns. I like having the Browns win. It's nice. So uh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. I may... Uh... Oh, shit. Thanks for being a shitty lineman, guy. That dude literally pulled, was running with me, and then I was get, there's like two guys coming at me, and he just like stops and goes the other direction. So I don't really, don't really understand what his uh, mindset was there. But I'm also not a AI generated uh, lineman, so you know my thought processes and his computer ass probably think two completely different things. Oh, the magician, folks! He just made him look like a fucking your uncle when he's cooking barbecue and he has on his flower apron. Ooh, Jesus. All right, um, we are going to, what are we going to do here? I'm going to do a play action, I think. I think I'm going to try to fool him a little bit. I'm going to try to get, uh, try to get something going here. I'm going to take, I'm going to hot rot holiday or holloway. So he cuts across. We're going to have like crossing patterns. So somebody's going to get confused. Oh, Jesus. Oh, he fought him off. Get out of here, bitch. Oh, my God. <laughs> wow, that was ugly. Holy shit. Damn, friends. That was whoo. All right. It's uh, we're going to we're going to do. And now we're at the two minute warning. Holy shit. Damn. That, this has been pretty ugly so far. I'm not I'm not all that happy with what, how I've been doing. So, all right. So now we're bringing in the third and fourth receiver, Patrick, the Colonel Kerr, who's the next person to take the step into the starter role. And then we got, I'm in a hurry, Curry over here. Somebody that I uh, picked up. He's basically, holy shit. That sack does not help my disposition. Third and 25, that seems reasonable. It's a nice little, uh, nice little way to start my day. Who wants, who wants to start their day like that? I do. Who doesn't? Me. All right, so we're going to run. Here's what, here's what the play looks like. We're going to actually we're gonna change the colonel because he's fucking fast. We're going to take Hanoian on a, a slant. We're also going to take In a Hurry Curry. We're going to run double streaks. And then Goodman, we're going to run him on a slant this way as well. So we're going to do a double slant, a double uh, in a hurry curry. Oh, there. Oh, my God. It's Colonel. Did he get? Oh, it bounced off his hands and then bounced off his hands. I got a punt, friends. Holy crap, dude. Holy crap. Man, I did trashy. Trashy, trashy, friends. Perfect punt. I don't know how. Per oh, God. Please let me smash you. Please. Please! Oh, damn it. I went low instead. I fucking hit stick too early. Oh, well. Oh, well. They all can't be winners. Right, friends? Don't score. Don't score. Ooh, you got it. All right. All right. All right. Fine. Fine. Now we got to play. Now we got to play two minute under one minute drill. That's not even two minute under one minute drill. That's the technical term, everyone. Uh, we're going to double slant. We're going to see what we can do here. Colonel! Got it. Is he out of bounds? Shit. All right. I, think I threw it a little too late. All right. All right. All right. We're going to do this. This automatically takes the Colonel deep. Takes Holloway deep. In a hurry, Curry. We're going to slant. So we'll see how it goes. We don't have a lot of time. We have timeouts. So that's important. Oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, he's got it. Oh, and he just faked them bitches out. Blad out. We got all three. I'm going to call timeout. I'm not worried about timeout since I have three. Uh, let's see here. We are going to... We're going to do a Trey Flex. Let's do a... All right. So we got Curl in the middle, Holloway on the edge, Hanoian cutting across. We're going to take Goodman on a slant, post route, whatever. All right. Let's take a look here. Um, who is open? Oh, fucking Hanoian. Oh, he got it. He galloped without his fucking head all the way there to make everyone his friend. He's Hanoian, the headless horseman. He has a million friends. Do you have a lot of friends? Put in the comments, how many friends do you have? I don't think it's as many as the headless horseman. Got the ball back after halftime. All right, we're going to start the, the second half out with... 
the magician, folks. We are going to have a fucking show of magic and prestidations that you will never ever see anywhere else. And he's fake. And he's tackled. Man, he hasn't been. He hasn't been. Uh, well, I mean, I guess he had a negative three run to start the fucking game, so it's not been. All right, here we go. We're gonna get. Uh, we're gonna get the the Dyson in here. The, the field's looking a little dirty on the right hand side. We need to bring in the Dyson, folks. The sweeper. We need to get him over there and clean up the goddamn environment. He is cleaning. Oh, get out of his face. He 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 can't take your dirty face home with him. He's gonna clean it before he goes. All right, let's take a look here. Does he have any way that he could be any cooler? Yeah, he could probably wear a pink headdress. That would make him a little cooler, I guess. Uh, maybe not? All right. He is... Oh, God, this shit is... Oh, shit. Yeah! Oh, my God, I threw it literally right to that guy. Hey, Zach the Dreamweaver. You're turning my, you're turning my dreams into a nightmare. I think what happened is... Uh, I gave him this big deal. Well, if, if you missed it, last season, Zach the Dreamweaver told me to go pound salt um, because my contract offer wasn't good enough. He wanted all the money. I was only giving him some of the money. So I let him go in the offseason. I was fully prepared. Oh, God, get out of my face. Get out of my first. I was fully prepared to move on without the Dreamweaver. We are going to make our own dreams. We are going to make our own dreams become our reality. Well, so he wanted to test free agency. There was only one other team that wanted him, and they offered him a super low contract. So as the cunning, shrewd businessman I am, I offered him a contract about like eight pennies more than what they offered him. And he ended up signing with me for the contract I basically offered him in the previous season that he rejected. So bottom line is he came crawling back to me. So now, I think he's I think now that he's got paid, he's a little butt hurt. I mean, he's got a little bit of sand in his fucking crotch that's rubbing, it's chafing, it's making him a little upset. You know, I can't help it. He can't help it. You know, it's just part of a uh, part of the realization that you are not what you thought you were. I mean, hey, We've all been there, right? We all were like, hey, I think I'm this. And they're like, nah, dog, you ain't. And then you're like, oh, goodness, man, now I feel like there's sand in my crotch. Who does, who actually likes sand in their crotch? Oh, my God, Colonel. There he is. He's jumping. He's grabbing. He's sticky mitting it like there's fucking honey on his paws, folks. Winnie the Pooh, he might as well be. So, uh, but, you know, so he's, I think he's just, he's, uh, He's adapting to his new mindset of how good he was. In uh, better terms, he thought he was Tom Brady. He turned out to be, oh, God, I'm going to die. Uh, he thought he was Tom Brady. He turned out to be more of like a Jay Cutler. And it hurt his heart, man. His heart is hurt. He's sad. I, I get it. I mean, come on, friends. You know, I understand that doesn't mean that I give a shit about him. So you got to remember that. Ooh, the Colonel. Bam, get your speed on, friend. Boom. He is the fastest fucking guy this side of the Mississippi. All right, so we are going to... We're going to give Carol Tall his other care... No, we're actually going to give... We're not going to bring in the Tallster yet. We're not bringing in the Tolster. Uh, we're bringing in this guy. He's he's the Dyson, folks. It's dirty. He needs to clean it up. That's what he's doing. And, oh, thank you, Miami, for a... Get off of his nuts, friends. Ooh, that's a good one. He's like, welcome to Thunderdome. Ooh, shit. They're all like... He was like, oh, Master Blaster's here? Who runs Border Town? Master Blaster runs Border Town. It's a uh, Mad Max Beyond Thunderdome reference for anyone who's out there. Oh, do you see him? Do you see him running magic? Oh, my God! He faked two men out and then had two more men pounding at his door. But, you know, the Magician can only do so much. We're actually going to give the Magician a bonus play. Right now, we're going to try to screen him. Uh, he is RB. 
This is gonna fail miserably. Just just throwing that out there. And who who can I throw to in a in a pinch? Okay, A. Oh god. Yeah, I knew that would work out terribly. They were ready for it. Alright, what we're gonna try here is to get something going. Whether it's Hanoian galloping down the sideline. Oh, Goodman. He's the goodest fucking man. Oh, that guy would have been more aggressive. It's cool. We're at the end of the third quarter. We're up by five. It's not as much as I'd like it to be, but you know, hey, they all can't be the best. It's not all cupcakes and rainbows all the time. So... Sometimes you got to settle for a fucking cloudy day and a uh, little Debbie Ho-Ho cake. You know, it's, it's, you can, you just got to make the bet. Oh my God, did you see him kick on the afterburners, bitch? Oh my God, he's so fast. It's like it's magic. Oh, it is magic because he's the magician, folks. He is fucking magical. He, I don't know what he's doing. He's losing his goddamn mind. But, you know, we'll take it. We'll take it. Oh, you guys want to come back, huh? Y'all want to play? You want to play that game? You want to make make me feel like I'm not good enough, huh? Fine then. Fine then. I will just fucking sail away on you. All right, let's see what we can do here. Da 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 da. Let's see. We're gonna we're just gonna run. We're gonna try to run some of the clock out. Ellis, the dice, and crushing his fucking face, Barker. God, he only has 80 yards, dude. Or 40 yards. Holy shit. We're going to try to get him some yardage here. I mean, I just need to run the clock anyway. So we're going to try a little draw. A little delayed handoff up the center. Seems to work a lot for when they're aggressively chasing me on the outside. They tend to falter when I go up the middle. Because they're used to me fucking going up. I wish that guy would have blocked him. He literally got there. And then the guy didn't... Uh, it's frustrating, man. I need I need the line to get better. I need better linemen. It's been a uh, it's been a problem in this game from day one. Um, so you know it's cool, man. I'll just keep running up the center. It seems to be working pretty good. I'm gonna do one more draw, three draws in a row. That should throw them off. Then I'm gonna sweep the shit back to the outside. Um, and go from there. Oh, God, see, now they're waiting for it. So now we'll get to the two-minute warning. It's, uh, what is it, third and eight. They get the clock stopped. These sons of bitches, they think they're special. They think they have a little fucking, uh, uh we're actually, I'm going to play action them right now. Because we got Holloway going over the top. We got Hanoian, so that's, they're only one safety deep, so that safety has to bite on one or the other. So one of the two should be open. Oh, yeah, it's Holloway. Mm, no, it isn't. Oh, but he's... Oh, he knocked it out. What a bitch. Are you serious, dude? All right, then. I guess I got a punt, man. Let's see if the D can hold him. Let's see if the D can do it. God, please let me get down there. Oh, my God. You let him go. Oh, my God, please. Oh, he called a fair catch. What a fucking skis. All right, guys. We're at a moment of truth here. I like to do this. I'm down by five. A minute 48 left. They score a touchdown. They go up. Will the simulated D hold up? Put in the comments what you think. We'll see who's right, who's wrong. Let's go. One, two, three. Put a comment. Go. We held them. We held them because we are good. We're going to just get back to running. Going to run the clock out. They only have one timeout. And we're going to keep moving. We're going to keep moving on. Ooh. Don't take me out of bounds, you fucking jerk. All right, then I'm going up the center. Yeah! This guy, he fucking thinks he's something special. I'm just going up the center, then. You guys can't drag me out of bounds when I go up the center. Da -da -da -da. Center. Ooh. No, no, no. What is going on? Thank you. Someone pick up the ball. Everyone in the entire game came by. All right. Well, I got the first with a weird fucking thing going on. So that's cool. Um, on that. Why do we have to booth review it? 
It doesn't matter if it was a fumble or not. I still got the goddamn ball back. So basically, I fumbled and I got the ball back, and then they checked it and said I didn't fumble. So either way, I still ended up with the ball. Boom! Take that to your mother's house. Uh, we're going to power O. We're going to power through it. We're going to power that O. We're going to get through it. We're going to do O things. O faces. O rings. Oh my. Oh Henry the candy bar. Oh, I threw him down like he was a fucking vacuum bag. He's like, I'm the Dyson, folks. I'm fucking bagless. I use a cylindrical container to do the things I do and you want to know. That's what he said. I mean, it's a lot. It's a lot for him to say, but that's what he said in that moment. And if he didn't say it, that's what he felt in his heart when he did it. So we're going to go back up the middle. Just fucking run the clock out. We'll take we'll take a victory. This was a little harder than more than most. Oh. Do you feel him? Do you feel Oh, I'm sorry. Let's What the fuck? Why is why do they show Maven like rolling around on the ground? He's excited, I guess. I guess he's allowed to be excited too. So all right, everybody, that is all the time that I have for today's episode. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. While you're at it, lie to your friends. Tell them that this is good and we should watch it too. I love all the people watching, everyone. But if you want to hang out after the game, I am going to do a little bit of between the week, you know, scouting, yada, yada. If you don't want to do that, you can go ahead and dip out. So if you want to hang out, sweet. If not, for Jonas, I am out. Zach the Dream Weaver pumping the fucking crowd up. Shit. All right, everybody. I am here. I'm getting into the off week shit. I always say off season, but it's not the off season. It's just the in between the week things. Uh, what do we got here? We got uh, my coach with like ridiculous amount of experience i don't need any more stuff i'll have to go in there at some point and do those we will go ahead and advance the week oh we play the patriots next week i think in this brand i think in this universe i think they're fucking trash um <clears throat> all right let me go ahead and start my weekly training all right i'm gonna try to give barker a better contract offer so you guys can see i'm gonna try I can't, I can't guarantee that's what's going to happen. But I'm going to try. I'm going to try to give him a little bit of a better offer. All right. Two people are ready to negotiate. These two cornerbacks, I'm not keeping. These are two cornerbacks I picked up a couple seasons ago. I'm not keeping them regardless. What does he want? He's not bad. He's 28. Oh, I may let him go too. I'm going to have to look at that guy. All right, Barker. What do we want here? Seven years, $96 million. So seven years. So if I put this out to seven years, you'd be at $81 million. Uh, let me see here. 85. Let's see. 7.5. Let me do. You should do this, I would think. Right? Seven years. He'll be old as shit by the time this is done. But I think I think this is reasonable. 85, 8. I think you're good. Why don't you, why don't you say you want this? I like the length of the contract, but that's about it. This dude is going to be a problem. I'm not going to pay him all the money. Did I actually, do I have my, my re-sign things? Spend coach XP. Do I have my re-sign players? Oh yeah, I already have the influence. Motherfucker. What the shit? Free agency influence. Pfft. All right, man, I already have that stuff, dude. Why Why are you trying to do me like that? All right, so let's go in here. <clears throat> let's scout players. Who have I already scouted? Uh, scout, what have I done? Left guards, centers. Those are my two weakest positions, of course. Um, linemen. So we got B minus right guard. That'll be my next position to upgrade. And I think they're getting old, too. Uh, so we'll do that. Oh, there we go. There's a lot of them here. Brady Burialt. I've never even fucking heard of that last name before. Reed Gallon. Zachary College with a D. Looks like he didn't go to college. That's pretty funny. Alexander Allred. He sounds cool. 
Wish my last name was Allred. Jonas Allred! Too bad it's not. We can't all be winners, you know? We can't all have amazing... All right, well, that's everything. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching this part of the video. I very much appreciate you guys hanging out. Um, I'm just going to... Fuck, man. Oh, I, wait, he can, yeah, he can get as good as he wants. All right, cool, what do I want? I'll get this here. Um, I already have him locked in for a while. I just don't want the Barker. But anyways, thanks for checking out uh, this part of the video. Very much appreciate it. Leave some comments. Let me know what you like. Let me know what you don't like. Um, I always get back to everybody in the comments. But uh, for Jonas, once I get done doing these upgrades real quick, I am out.